All right, welcome back. So now I am on to the first run, which hopefully should be the only run and the playthrough that we're looking for. I'm gonna click on new run here. And basically there's a story mode that I go through. And if I lose at any time in the story mode, it just sends me back to the beginning. Uh, I think that's what they call a roguelite. Making the gorillas get name known. That was our only way into New Braca. New Braca, mother fraca. So I broke bots. King talked smooth. And we landed our first real fight. Fantastic. Gotta love that. Oh man, yeah, this is this is pretty cool. It's like a comic book, but it's a 3D comic book. This place was called the Kill Box. Locals came to see fights to the death. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I hear you. Oh, there's the underdog's logo. That's pretty sick. Was the uh, was time the gorilla stepped into the jungle? You'll see my pronunciation is going to be pretty bad at a lot of these things because the, the slang that they've got in this game is not real life slang, but it's close to real life slang. But I don't talk in slang, so it's uh, it's tough for me. Here we are in the kill box. Shot, baby. Oh, look how beautiful it is. Yo, check it. You can see the brock up there. Inshallah. You ready for this? There we go. Okay, yeah, so before I start this, I'm going to go into this third person perspective. So give me a second. All right, I'm back in the third person perspective. Here we are. I see. Maybe I can wave to the back of me. I think that's looking at you. I don't know if you can see my face, but yeah. Hi, spectator camera. Here we go. Put my hands there. Calibrating. Get this shite. Right, wherever the enemies might be coming out of that door. Here we go. Time to mess some shite up. So I could just like smash and bash on the ground and just do these overhead hits over and over. Or I could punch the car into them. Oh, I totally missed that. And it's pretty nice to like send them the same way. So that, oh, or send them into the spikes. I didn't know there were spikes there. That's pretty sick. And send them over here. So yeah, they hit the spikes. These cockroaches, at least, they're they're pretty wimpy. They die pretty instantly. So you don't even need to hit them into the spikes. You can kind of just like bash them on the head. All right, here we go. Do the head bash. This is the way to just like endlessly kill them. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to do that though. I want to get these clean punches that send them flying. Yeah, baby. And when, when I send them into each other, it does a crap ton of damage. Let's see if I can hit this. Yeah, hit the car right into the roach. All right, my first victory. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Oh, I like Zikita too. Perfect. Bashing is 50% more physical impact or cash. I'm going to go for cash because I don't really care about this bash damage. I tend to not do much bash damage. It's pretty risky. Okay, perfect. Got me some monies. First win. King and I went celebrating at the Killbox Club. Oh yeah, here's the big wins. Cheers. But I gotta make a bigger splash. What kind of splash are we making here? Gotta take the Killbox Championship from whoever holds it. Killing a champion would give me a name, and a name would get me and King closer to the city walls. Yeah, I've got my, my epic voice here. Hated sleeping in the truck. I like a bed I can sprawl in. New day in the jungle. Tonight's fight will be harder. The streets are full of ways to spend cash and get stronger. Buy, hustle, steal, do what you need. You got three moves. Make your choices count. Yes, ma'am. Or, or sir. I don't know who said that to me. But yeah, that is that. That was the first day. Um... I'm gonna pause there, make sure the recording is working out all right, and I will be right back. All right, I am back at it, here we are. I'm gonna go to the shop because I do not need any repairs right now. Repairs could be helpful, even though I don't need stuff because I could get a, a repair that constantly repairs me. Stepped into a mechanic's wet dream, there you are, look around. Zika ran a tight body shop. We looked around. Uh, so Zikita is the person that I just got. Um, and so we don't want to lose her reputation. 
Uh, so over here we've got reputation, who you know and what's your reputation. So she's the only one that I know so far because um, I already used her as the person who was giving me stuff. I, I forgot exactly what that, my representative, I guess. Um, well, I guess it says rep, so yeah, it's probably representative but no it's reputation i don't know but yeah she i've already met her she owns a body shop sells arms physical and locomotion gear i like locomotion gear and physical gear uh, and i guess i kind of i like arms too so yeah all of the stuff she sells i like so i don't want to burn the relationship if i steal something i'm gonna burn the relationship actually i risk burning it i don't want to risk it so i'm gonna get one of these things or nothing and objects have a better chance of hitting other objects when punched or bashed. So it's like auto aim for punching stuff. Could be pretty cool. Bashing does 50% more impacts. Um, oh, it says aimbot. Yeah, no, I like chaos aimbot. I'm gonna try that. And yeah, we're already low on cash. So that probably wasn't the best purchase, but whatever. <laughs> I'll take it. Okay, so now we could hail or shop some more. I can't really shop because I don't have much money. So I'm gonna hail. Basically looking for trouble. <laughs> Arrived to find a box with a note for the killer in the rilla. Little something from a fan. Okay, who the fuck gives a shit like this for free? Uh, slick quirk box, 50% power, when over 50% HP. Okay, yeah, I'm always gonna be over 50% HP. That's me being cocky, but I'll take it. That seems like a pretty good nut thing. And I mean, I can always repair if I get under 50 or use the other arm. Um, okay, and then hail. I'm gonna hail again because I still don't have much money. Look for some more trouble. What does that smell? Hills of metal junk, lakes of battery acid. Had to be something useful to find here. We had to start somewhere. Those upgrades looks like add-ons there. Um, so <sighs> upgrades. The the run that I won in this game, I did a bunch of upgrades near the end, and. That's probably the way to do it. Add-ons are kind of fun, but you probably are going to be replacing add-ons the more you play, and it's kind of a waste. You can sell them, but I don't know. I, I think I like upgrades because I think it's it's fairly easy to get to a certain point in this game without any add-ons. Fingers bleeding, but we got us a find. Plus, I already have an add-on. Cockpit heals. Okay, so that's this is the thing that you can get from the repair station that... I would is basically good no matter what um and so i, I kind of just got lucky here deep in we started to see scavengers eyeing us and so they the scavengers could catch us and steal our stuff um but the things that i got were not super important so far so i'm just gonna say what the hell and go for it keep on searching guys cool yeah so <laughs> totally worth it i got a rare part which is kind of insane. Um, and yeah, 200 HP. This early in the game, that's just kind of crazy. Locomotion when using this arm. Uh, four add-on slots as opposed to, I think, two is the default. Repairs are 100% more effective. 50% incoming damage reduction when HP is under 30%. That's just, yeah, yeah, this, this is a really good, <laughs> really good arm. Um, oh, we are not giving that up. We're fighting. Heck yeah. Wait. <laughs> I mean, it, it was, I think this was worth it still, even though they stole all the stuff. Um, I didn't really need this that much, and this is definitely worth that risk. So I think I made the right choice, but unfortunately lost the RNG. And that is part of the, the rogue light is RNG. It's nighttime, uh, or night time to fight. The fighting pits run on patrons. Okay, patrons, that, that's what they are, not representatives, patrons. Each offers a challenge for a reward. Choose who you want to get cozy with. Higher rep will pay you off. Cool, well, oh, higher rep will pay off. Okay, yeah, so we're trying to earn a reputation with this girl right here, um, which I can't really directly point out, but below choose a pa patron, Zikida, I think is her name. Whatever that was, already probably forgot it. Um, okay, so yeah, Z Zikita. It is Zikita. I think that's how you pronounce it. Who, who knows? But locomotion, physical gear, enemies that explode on death. I'll take it. I don't care if enemies explode on death because I can just walk away from them. This is the garage. Equip your shit here before every fight. Play around. You'll see what goes on where. Okay, cool. So we've got this quirk, uh, and it's an upgrade. I don't want to upgrade yet. I want to save those upgrades until I got a better arm. So if I got that last arm, I probably would have put it on there already. But um, 
the aimbot. I like the aimbot, and so the aimbot works on my cockpit, so basically whenever I punch with anything, not just a certain arm, it'll give me that aimbot, which is pretty, pretty freaking sweet. And so I'm gonna save the aimbot for enemies that are particularly dangerous, so that I can go grab an object, not grab it, but punch an object and kill people. I'm gonna say hi to my, to my spectator here and get right into it. Here we go. Calibrating. All right, so yeah, I can punch that object. I can punch these cars. I can punch that. I mean, I can bash into it too with my, my front. Oh, sweet. Oh, oh I, I gotta kill this guy before the others come out. Oh, I already hit the car. Shoot. Okay, so yeah, he, he exploded. Well, did he explode yet? I think he did. Oh, and that guy. Yep, that guy's exploding. And bam! Oh man, these guys are going crazy. Okay, so I guess that's the aimbot that's like pulling them. <laughs> it's basically pulling them into the spikes. So that is pretty incredible. Bam, bam. Yeah, they're all kind of going towards the spikes here. Um, but yeah, no, this, <laughs> this seems pretty overpowered. Right off the bat, I've got these overpowered weapons. <laughs> well, no, I guess it's only one weapon because I've got... It's only on my... No, it's on both. That's right. Yeah, because it was the cockpit add-on. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. Pretty freaking sweet. Go over there. He explodes anyway. Well, I don't have to kill him. Sticky bombs with legs. Over there. Yeah, right on the spike. Kaboom! Alright. Yeah, this is kind of like... This is a cheeky strategy. I, I was saying how like just bamming, smashing them on top is a cheeky strategy, but honestly, this is this is more cheeky. <laughs> but I love it. I love it. Rah. Okay, wait, this guy didn't die. Okay. Get out of here. Oh, gotta run away. Yeah, so I'm getting a good amount of lag because I'm doing Steam VR. Um, and basically, oh, this guy. Um, <laughs> my network connection is not, not ideal in the location that I'm playing. Okay, there we go. Perfect. However, that was pretty sweet. Got my stuff done and, uh, ooh, already a nice swinger or a quirk box. There's an upgrade. Upgrades again. Oof. It's only two add-on slots. I, I kind of care more about the add-on slots than you'll... You'll probably see later why, but um, I'm not going to explain that too in, de in depth of why I'm not going to choose this. This might be the best choice, but I'm not going to do it. I'm just going to save up my add-ons for the end. Maybe not the end, but later. King was out all night getting plugged. Fuck knows what he up on. Plugged, because he's got like this thing in the back of his head. Maybe he was plugging in to charge or something. Uh, <laughs> Repairs, so I don't need repairs. I'm full health, I think, still. Yep, did not get hit once. Fairly easy stuff, as I said. Hail, go looking for trouble. But yeah, if you don't understand the mechanics, it's not gonna be super easy. But once you understand the mechanics and you really start getting it, as long as you can throw solid punches, it's it, this game is fairly easy, especially when you start. Another box, another note. Keep it up, Riggin King from yours truly. Yes, sir. What do you know? Another piece of tech. This was getting weird. Hot box. Okay, so I don't... Overheated is pretty good, but only 15% chance doesn't really do much. Oh, but we don't... We can't get more. Oh, well. Um, okay, 10% off because we earned a uh, reputation with her. And so I'm going to go there because we've got a decent amount of cash now. Maybe she's got some good stuff to offer. I'll pay you tomorrow. We walked into in on a beef. Zakita owed some cash. Oh, poor Zakita. <laughs> The main man suggested we take something and leave. What? Bro, I'm gonna cover Zakita. Take on him and leave or just leave. Nah, we're covering. Yeah, we paid them. They didn't like it, but King smoothed it out and they left. All right, what's she gonna do for us? Ten only 10% off after that? Oh, that's crazy. Well, hey, we're, we're building reputation even if she's not really giving it to us. Uh, locomotion plus four add-ons or three add-ons with kinoflectic. Um, yeah, so th this is basically more invulnerable of an arm. This is a little faster. 
I can move myself around faster. And four add-on slots is better than three, even though the more health is better. Um, I prefer locomotion, so I'm gonna go this one. Fastest hand in the West. <laughs> sure. Um, all right, I'll leave there. And we're gonna buy, no, no. We only have 170, oh gosh, I didn't realize how expensive that was. Even 10% off. Looked like whoever hailed us had some misfortune while he was waiting. I guess he's dead, oh man. There was a piece of hardware lying by him. Whoever hit this guy wasn't after his goods. Magic cards. Let's you choose which item you want to try stealing. Doesn't stack. Okay, I like that. Search further, because I don't really care for that RNG stuff. This Merc surely had something to offer. Ooh, Kinoflectic arm, okay. That's possibly pretty sweet. Okay, wow, that was it. Choose a patron. Yeah, this is a pretty good run. Um, this, <laughs> this might just be like the one run. I, I won't have to do multiple runs. It should be pretty easy. But yeah, I'm, I'm gonna keep building my reputation with Zikita. And we're gonna destroy some things. And the more you play, the more people that you're un gonna unlock to build the re reputation with them. And so, and each run you do, I think the reputation resets but you have to unlock each person by doing more runs. And there's like 20 or 30 people, I think, uh, that you can earn reputations with. So that it's a pretty pretty cool thing that I didn't really know and look into until recently. But yeah, okay, so we've got this hardened thing, Kinoflectic, which is just like an invulnerable arm almost, and then locomotion using this arm. So I'm gonna do locomotion on my left. We're moving around and then punching on my right because that is my dominant hand. Um, enemies that damage this hard armor bounced away and then I get 50% incoming damage reduction when HP is under 30%, which I don't know, I guess could help at some point. Plus 50% power when over 50% HP. Yeah, that that's awesome. That's uh, the add-on, isn't it? Add no, it's an upgrade that we have over here. Same thing as that. Um, but we've, we've got the quirk already added onto it, so that's pretty sweet. Okay, so now I can I can sell these swingers at some point, uh, the default swingers, uh, and then I'm just still again gonna stack up these quirk boxes at some point, um, and I I'm not gonna use them yet on this arm because I think I can get even better arms. Kinoflectic isn't my favorite. I, I think these generic, more generic arms are. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I might end up adding stuff to that, but right now I just simply don't need it. So we're fighting. Underdogs. Alright, not ready yet because I gotta wave to my audience. Hi guys. Hey guys. Bye guys. And and gals. If any of the gals are watching. I think my YouTube stats show that like 99% of the people that watch me are, are guys, but I don't know. I don't know how accurate that is because I've definitely had ladies that are chatting. Okay, so that that is why the aimbot is pretty freaking awesome. Um, these, uh oh, okay, oh, they're exploding. That's right. So, yeah, I can punch this car into the dude. Oh, that was a terrible punch. Wow. Bam. Okay, just finish that guy. Yep, he's dead. And then I'm gonna smash the. Oh, terrible. Smash, smash, smash. Uh, those were some pretty bad punches. I'm kind of kind of lame. Oh. Wow, I didn't realize that guy was coming over there. Oh, I don't have anything more to punch. Wait, I can punch them into each other. Oh, wait, I'm just missing everything. That's fine. We don't need to hit each other. Okay, they hit each other. And, okay, that, when he's blue, if I punch him, he will just automatically do damage to me. And he'll basically just, like, make my arm stuck. And so that's, it's not ideal to let that happen. Perfect! I think that was the end, or that was just a little slow. Yeah, I'm fighting for the Killbox Championship, baby. Ooh, we got spikes. Okay, so if I hit these guys in their spikes, then they do damage to me. So I just, I generally just try to headshot them. Okay, as I say that, I just did not headshot them. <laughs> That's okay. Uppercut. It was more of a flick cut. Uppercut. Oh, shoot. There we go. Oh, that guy didn't even get, like, stuck. Oh, not quite. There we go. Alright. Sweet. Any more dudes? Got dudes over here. Bam! 
Oh, that's that's perfect. Okay, this guy's got armor, so um, when I punch it, it's kind of like spikes, but it doesn't damage me. It just defends him, which I mean makes sense. But yeah, this aimbot <laughs> is pretty awesome. Oh, did that hurt me? I don't think it did. Hi -ya. Oh, yeah. Punch, punch. Yeah, baby. I wish I could move my arms in this little end screen here. Okay. Cruise control. Oh, locomotion glides. I love this. Oh my gosh. That, that was, this was the first run that I played. I got this cruise control and it's freaking awesome. Um, yeah, I don't care for this arm. I want my cruise control. Yes. I also hope that I don't accidentally click stuff because I do that sometimes. Uh, and that, that screwed me up in the past. Also, this little VR setup he's going he got going here is sick. That's like the future right there. He's probably wearing like a pair of contacts that are just as strong as this headset that I'm wearing right here. Um, and that is the future of technology right there, in my opinion. Um, maybe just not anytime soon. <laughs> uh, well, I, he also might be just like controlling it from the chip in his head. So it's like a Neuralink type thing mixed with a, a contact lens type thing. I don't know, I don't know. King wasn't looking good that morning. Silicon bitch was clawing at his defenses. Oh yeah, he's, he's doing hack in there or, or uh, cybersecurity, not hacking because she was trying to attack him. Yeah, okay. Um, repairs, don't really need it. I took, I think one hit, yeah. And so <laughs> that's like absolutely nothing, especially when you got 300 health as opposed to the usual. Oh, sorry, I just accidentally went into my menu. Okay, exit out of that. Go hail and look for some trouble. Had to start somewhere. Upgrades or add-ons. We're going for add-ons. This is the run of add-ons. Fingers bleeding, but we got ourselves a find. Uh, mesh stabilizer, in incoming damage reduction, and minus power. That's terrible. I am going to sell that the soonest chance that I get. Because I don't care for damage reduction. I just care for power. Um... What the hell or enough for today we're, we're what the hell is because yeah the what we just got was absolutely useless i could i could lose it and not care at all okay we'll take that and leave i guess oh okay we're fighting these guys just because i don't really care for any of it okay <laughs> well i guess this is kind of good when hp is under 30 it's not really though because my hp is never going to get under 30 let's be real i'm too good for that just kidding i i definitely have lost this game before so <laughs> Definitely not too good for that. Um, okay, 1270. Still not a lot of money, so I'm going to go hail. And the shop isn't with the, the lady that we have a reputation with, so we don't have a discount. This was starting to get familiar. Kill Usam dead. Take that chain, and we'll be seeing each other soon. An investment. A shared enemy, either way, made off with another piece of tech. Sweet. Yeah, I'll take that. I might use that on my left arm now that I have this glider. Oh, sweet. Okay, 20% off. Eh, I still don't have a ton of money, um, but I can sell. So I'm going to, I think I can sell at shops. I mean, that would only make sense, right? She passed us back, said she threw in a good word to friends of hers too. Okay, yeah. So whenever we get the chance, I'm going to come to this lady uh, so that we can get some cool stuff. Oh, cool. So I got reputation for these guys as well. That's pretty nice. Um, and, and cash. That's freaking awesome wait okay we gotta click the guy we stayed to check out gear so what's a good choice to come here i think okay so th this quirk we could just stack up on this quirk forever and just have like a super overpowered arm um which i might do but gridlock plus 50 percent power oh that's just like a direct upgrade to this yeah this is just simply better <laughs> Okay, well, 50% uh, power to both arms. Okay, and that's like another direct upgrade. It's a cockpit though, so it takes up one of those spaces. I could get both or just one. This is like a common. This is more, I'll, I'll do this one because I'm, I'm stacking up on uh, upgrades, but I might as well have an add-on, uh, a cockpit add-on. I'll probably get some better stuff at some point, but building up my reputation with her is never a bad thing as well. So I'll take it. What do we got next? Choosing a patron. Um, go for same lady, of course. The best reputation that we've got. There's probably not much of a reason to keep going with her if my reputation's already as best as it can be, but I'm gonna try it anyway and see what happens. You guys can tell me in the comments if I'm really dumb for doing that. But locomotion glides until stopped. 
we. Yeah, I love that. I really do say the word we when I use that. Um, you'll see. But gyronaut locomotion when using this arm and four add-ons. Okay, yeah, that's this is just perfect. Um, even though this has the damage reduction and power, this also has... No, it doesn't have power. I lied. Um, but I, I can put on quirks, and I prefer to have locomotion. Ooh, do I? Yeah, I probably do. I'll, I'll just do that. Cool. Oh, I also forgot to sell my stuff. I'll sell it later. Or or maybe I couldn't sell it there. I don't really know. I don't really know. But, yeah, so I'm basically going to be going really fast now. And, uh, well, I can go fast with both arms. Yeah, I'm ready. Gorilla OS, baby. See me in the ring. Here we go. Okay. Let's get it. Oh, shoot. No, I didn't mean to hit that. Oh, yeah, I glide. I forgot. So I just, like, I constantly keep moving until I stop myself, which is pretty awesome. I love that. I go, wee. Okay, I'm just going to wait until this guy stops being blue. Man, it's taking so long. Okay, come on, dude. Just shut up for a second. There we go. Ugh. Oh, I'm just missing. I guess, I guess it is kind of hard to control once you get to the that point. Ooh. Oh, man. I'm hitting him too hard. There we go. Perfect. Okay. We're all exploding. I gotta, like, constantly grab the ground so I don't, like, run into random things. Let's put this guy in the grinder. Oop. There we go. Nope. Not in the grinder. Go in the grinder. Ah, he died before he hit the grinder. That's okay. We'll get... Ooh. Got a blue guy. There we go. Grinder, baby. Ah, too far to the left. There we go. Grinder. Not quite. The spikes. Whatever. Yeah, if I just hit them that direction, they're just dead. Because they've got spikes and the grinder. There you go. Grinder, baby. Hoorah! Sweet. So even when they're exploding, I can hit them towards this guy. Oh, I don't need to do that. Go. Yes. Go. Yes. Hit this. Sh oh, yes. Yeah, baby. Get away. <laughs> oh, that's beautiful. That is beautiful. What do we got next? Any more dudes? I haven't taken any damage yet. Jinx. Oh. Oh, there we go. Now, I'm trying to like aim my punches here, which is kind of difficult to do. But I mean, I do have aimbot, so it's not, I guess, too difficult. Oh, get yes into the pit, and then into this. Oh gosh, go 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 into the thing. There we go. There we go. Perfect. You're dead. Who else? Oh. I gotta hit that. Yes. Did that did that guy just die in one hit as a was that a big dog? Oh shoot. No! I got hurt! That was silly! I got distracted! Life lesson learned, don't get distracted. Victory baby. Zikita. Yeah, so three percent. Oh man, that's tragic. But I think did I get that health thing? No, I think I got stolen from me. Oh well. Okay, so I don't need this anymore. Wait, no. I think I do. Oh shoot. Okay, let's go to the mech. Figure out what is this? Um, four add-ons and four add-ons. So this this is the same thing as this. Unless I'm missing something, which I don't think I am. Okay. This thing plus we some power for every two add-ons equipped to this arm. Oh, that's perfect. <laughs> that is. Oh, that's exactly what I wanted. Thank you very much, Zikita. You are freaking awesome. Truly freaking awesome. Okay. Yo, it's Usam. Some new fighter wrecked the kill box tonight. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. I'm not Usam, by the way. Two newcomer base boys from London. Called they Mech Gorilla, believe it? No shit. Yeah, th this is Usam right here. Bald guy. Just kidding. Mohawk guy. Man, newcomers come and go. Just one thing. Stay true around here. Usam! Oh, he's so spooky. Oh, look at his mech up there. That's, that's scary stuff. 
Sam holds the chain. Killbox champion for all motherfucking time. Okay. All right. Day five. The AI kept King up all night trying to hack into his brain. Poor kid. Yeah, where's the AI? I don't see the AI anymore. But it, it's funny. This this game is like sucking into all these people's fears of AI is going to take over the world. Which, uh, I mean... There's always some bad potential for technology. I'm on the optimistic side, but we'll see what happens. Um, act one, welcome to Jungle Day 5. Here we go. Yeah, this is, ah, oh, this scenery is just like cool. Just looking at it, like, oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. Repairs or hail. I don't really need repairs 3%. Who cares? Um, we're hailing. Also, look at the rep here, real quick. So we've got 20% off. I wonder if we can gain more. We'll, we'll see if we can gain more, even though it's already 3 these guys only one and one so whatever there um let's go hail look for some trouble don't need repairs once again had to start somewhere are those upgrades or add-ons we want upgrades fingers bleeding but we got ourselves a fine 10 to max 10 plus 10 to our max hp that's a weird way to phrase it but refills every day that's pretty awesome um i might i'm gonna say what the hell because I don't take damage. <laughs> Even though I just did. Just ignore that. Uh, stable shot, five to physical physical damage. Negates outgoing stun damage. Eh, that's probably decent. Oh, but cool. Okay, I just left with it. Sweet. That is exactly what I wanted. Let's go to the shop. I have 1690. Eh, do I want the shop? I probably want the shop. I think I want the shop. I'll get the shop. I can sell stuff here too. I can figure out what I want and what I don't. Okay, let's see your tight body shop. Um, oh, sweet. Okay, so this is blue. This is a little bit better than what we had. We've got um, this has locomotion. This does not. This also does not have locomotion. So I don't care about these two. This one kind of. Can I sell stuff? I don't think I can sell stuff. I gotta find like a some other thing to sell stuff I, I forgot exactly what i have to find to sell stuff but um well maybe i just have to click one of these first let's do do i want this it is 225 okay so that's some extra health um it is blue so it's a little bit better is this okay that's better than this so we could replace this with this which oh wait it only has three add-on slots we want four uh even though we have zero add-ons right now um it's good to have a lot of add-ons, slots at least. So I'm gonna keep this, keep what I got, save my money a little bit, and uh, yeah. Sorry, Zikita, no business for you. I w wish I could have sold stuff, but oh well. We're gonna go hail looking for trouble. Maybe at the shop I could have sold stuff. Bratas from the outside itching for cash. This chance man has a crowd around his casino machine. You boys feeling lucky? Item for cash with a chance to get double or nothing. Um, oh, heck yeah. Yeah, I don't need... I do not need these swingers. They're the same thing. They're the default swingers. Who cares? I always roll red for some reason. And uh, it worked. Cool. Color showed and we got cashed up for double the value. Red is like my least favorite color too, but that's okay. Made it work. Made it work. Okay. Usam! So this is the end of the first act, I believe, if I can beat this guy, which uh, if I don't beat this guy, you guys make fun of me in the comments because uh, for a person who's already played this game, this is a little easy. <laughs> a little. What am I talking about? Okay. So, yeah, it's still... I, I really want to put this on just because it's a cool, nice, like, legendary type color, even though it's rare. Um, but no, we want... We want the stuff that we already got. Uh, did I buy? I didn't buy something, right? Okay, so we want the arm add-on. This thing, plus 50% power for every two add-ons equipped. So we're going to put one add-on here, which, what was that? It was plus five to base damage. Yeah, I guess we can have some damage with less stun damage. Um, oh, plus arm max, max HP. We're just going to max the heck out of this, this arm. Well, yeah... I guess. Yeah, we'll we'll do that. And it refills every day, so to the heck with it. Uh, I think I might have forgot to do that last yesterday, but oh well. Um, we got the quirk boxes. We got everything. Okay, we're good. We're good to fight. Let's go beat some noobs. Get this on the road. 
in the ring. Not on the road. We're not on the road. All right, here we go, guys. Wish me luck. Into the battle. Battlefield. I like when it lights up, like it's totally dark, and then we got light. Brings the light. Okay. Here we go. Oh man. Go, go, go. In there. <laughs> I get so much lag right when I, I first spawn into this stuff. But eventually, oh, did I hit that guy? I think I did. Ooh. I don't even know where I'm hitting these guys. My aimbot's just like totally taking over. Oh shoot. Wow. It is kind of hard to control this uh, this movement. Oh. Why am I not hitting them into this uh, that? <laughs> That's what I should be hitting them into. Oh shoot. Oh. Hit these dudes. Hit them into each other. Oh. Sweet. All right. You can get some extra power into your punch if you zoom towards them, I believe. So I try to try to zoom. Okay. So that was that was the round before Usam. I don't think I took any damage, so it should be pretty easy. There I am. And oh, I don't actually know what you guys are looking at right now. Whether it's my view or the, the orbit view bubble view. Oh, he's so spooky. Hussam. Don't kill me, man. Okay. Um. Cool. Who the fuck let you in here? You lost nobody, baseball beach. I'm not here to talk, here to fight. Okay. Yeah, I thought they were talking for a second, but it was just the music. <laughs> okay. Here to fight. And I'll wipe this pit with your face and throw your headless body into the desert. Let's go, Goldilocks. Yes, sir. I'm going. Hey, yo. Yeah, yeah. So this is super easy when you have the locomotion that I have to just, like, go in and out. They call it weaving and boxing, I believe. Let's just do two punches at once. The double punch. I don't think you can double punch, actually. I think you can only jab, though. Maybe. Wait. the... Okay, no, you can do more. I, th I should just be punching with my right, though, because I think it's stronger. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, shoot. Okay, yeah. So this is the part where it's really nice to have locomotion. <laughs> you can just get the heck away from anything that comes up at you. There you go. Okay, yeah, so Usam, as you can see, is quite easy. You're going to witness murder in this game, unfortunately. Or fortunately, whatever twisted minds are out there. Moment of truth, bruv, you gotta do it, arg motherfucker, don't! No, don't! Yeah, sorry, I gotta, I gotta do it, man. You can skip Go this ahead, if you really don't want to kill a human, but... So, here we got my little thing here. hi -ya! Oh, wait, did that even get on? It looked like I was not close enough, but that's okay. Never killed a man on his knees, but my brother brother's life. Wait, where, where's the brata? Oh, man. Brother's life hung on it. Yeah, yeah. Brata. Brata ta 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 ta. Rig, you champion. You, the champ champion. Man, I suck at slang. Yo, what's up with your crown? You I? Right? Uh-oh. It's getting a little fuzzy. He's losing it. Looks like your brata. There, there's the brata. That's what you needed. Looks like your brata needs to get into the city soon. Brata ta ta. You can get us in. I can get you to a backdoor run if you come fight for me. Question mark? A backdoor run, Brata. Pass and it's welcome to New Braca. Braca, Brata. <laughs> uh, that's fun. Uh, you win my pits championship and I'll make it happen. All right, let's see it. Man was called Jay Abizi. We followed deeper into the jungle's guts. Was a crack in the landscape. Jay's pit was down there. A place called the Crack Zoo. We were on tomorrow night. Yes, sir. Put me on tomorrow night. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I need. Yeah. Reputation precedes me. From that lady to this guy. Thank you very much. Uh, Zikita to Leonardo. It's not 
Ardo. It's Ado. Interesting. Uh, bubble wrap or hardened colliders. After taking damage, the cockpit becomes invulnerable for three seconds. Or bashing an enemy makes the cockpit invulnerable for two seconds. Taking damage or bashing. I, I hate both of these. Bashing makes more sense, I'd say. But it's risky. It's risky to bash, so I almost never do it. And then taking damage, the cockpit becomes invulnerable. Um, I don't ever want to take damage, so it just, like, who cares? <laughs> um, I, I'm going to do the bash because I'll try to bash a little bit more if I get the chance. Day six, guts wasn't much better than the squats. Still rain like a motherfucker. Okay. Cool. So we're on day six. I believe this is act two. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and stop the recording there. Hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you in the next act. And uh, yeah, peace out.